Alright, hello everybody, welcome to a new game on the channel called Enter the Gungeon. Where, well, I guess it's better if I just show you how to play. Because I'm not really good at explaining things, but... Starting off this new year, I want to start expanding with a few more games to the channel. So, starting off here, let's go on ahead and just jump straight into this. So, it's a roguelike RPG, where, of course, you are main character, whichever of the, I think it's five, you choose. And there's a dodge roll to, you know, dodge out of the way of bullets. And there's, of course, all of these bullets that want to kill you with guns, because it's funny. <laughs> and your HP's up here. I do gotta keep an eye on those little ghost guys. But, uh... Of course, always reload and all that. These are what are called blanks. Which basically blank out all the bullets around you. Alright, so... Now, I just want to preface this for everyone. I'm not all too good at these games. And I always end up forgetting about some of my most powerful items. Like that, I completely forgot the dodge roll there. And that little shield is now gone, because that was basically an armor. Oh, hey, we got a ooh, new gun. Pick this up. The hammer. Now, also something I want to make sure that everyone knows. This is not a new save file. I have played a little bit of this before. And I can go ahead and show that off here. With all the different guns that I've found. But I haven't gotten far in the game. So I was thinking, you know, why not add this to the channel as a cool game to play? Ooh. We have another chest. We don't have the keys to open it right now, so let's go ahead and try to find some. Alright, so. Also, you can flip up these tables to use as shields. This gun shoots really fast. Oh. That was a close one there. Alright, dodge roll through. And then take that guy down. And the grenades ones will, of course, jump at you and explode. Which is why I try to keep them at least a little bit away from me. And I realize now that I am running out of bullets fast on that thing. Alright. So let's see what's around. Because we do still need that key to open up that chest over there. Alright, so let's go ahead and deal with this guy. And like in every other, like, roguelike RPG kind of thing, there is, like, a floor boss once you get to the end of each floor. And there's the floor boss there. I won't be fighting that right now, because I prefer to keep my life. And I should probably open up that chest before I do anything more. Which, if I can do. Because, uh... Swiftly running out of rooms to get keys from. Probably should reload between rooms here. Oh, the dynamite will also try to run at you and explode. Whoa! And these night guys make, like, big bullet barrages here. Alright. Thank you, table. I probably should have reloaded while he was attacking. Alright. And... Lots of grenades... Lots and lots of grenades. Okay. So. But basically, this is going to be the pilot episode for if this will become an actual, like, series on the channel. And I... If anyone has any more cool games that they want me to test out on stream, go ahead and let me know, and I'll go ahead and see what I can do. Because I've got a few games that I want to do for streams and videos and stuff. Preferably not running into the bullets, but, uh... But some of them being a Lobotomy Corporation and Skyrim are both on the list for ones that need pilot episodes and all that. Actually, that's right, I got teleportation. I keep forgetting that you can teleport in this game. Let's go ahead and open this, see what we get. We get a... what is this? Melted rock. Corpses explode. That's cool. I'm going to use this to call a reload for that. There we go. So now the hammer is reloaded. We should probably come down and check the shop. 
because I realized that we didn't do that yet. And I completely missed where the shop was. Alright. So. Let's see what we got in here. We got Clown Mask. We got Ammo th Synthesizer. Woo. Interesting. Hmm. But yeah, so... As you can see here by the fact that that person was in there in the back, uh, I have played through this a little bit. I have ended up freeing a couple of people from the gungeon here, which means that they'll now try to help us here in the gungeon. I should probably try to save my ammo there. Alright, so these guys are little uh, rubber bullets. They'll actually not do damage, but they'll push you around. Oh, grenades though. There is a uh, rubber bullet variant that's a, a taser bullet. And those ones do hurt you and knock you back. Oh, another chest. Was there a key in the shop? Just... Hmm. There is an achievement for if you flip enough tables. Hopefully we'll get that at some point. Oh. Another big hammer guy. No, that's not a hammer, that's a sword. Excuse me, good sir. Alright, and those bats basically uh, shoot themselves at you. Whoa. Alright, yep. And that is that room cleared. Now one thing that you can do here, is you can actually uh, use the water to put out this... the fire that's over there. I'm gonna push this out of the way. And it's actually how you unlock a secret room. So let's go ahead and... Oh, and I added a bunch of new songs to the BGM for the new year and all that. And that should... Yep. Put that out. Like here. And where did that open? Right there, actually. Alright, so let's see what we got. Wait, was this the alternate route? Or was this... Yeah, this is the alternate route. Okay. Let's not do alternate route because that always kills me. Alright, so let's head up to this last room and see if I can get another key there. Nope, it's just a bunch of bats. Yep, a bunch of bats, okay. Even more bats. And done, alright. Maybe I can go and buy those uh, wax wings. I think those let me fly, don't they? Did I pick them up yet on this file? I need to check it out. I feel like I did pick up the wax wings at some point. Hmm. Yeah, there. Grant flying while retaining maneuverability. So that is... pretty good. And actually would really help. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to buy those. Let's go over here to the store. I mean, there is a key on sale for 25. That is steep. For a, like a chance to get something that we may not even alright oh but that increases curse okay well let's hope the boss isn't too crazy let's head over here and the bosses are where my gameplay ends up going stupid so let's see if I can actually beat this one it is trigger twins it seems okay at least it's not the king because the king one I'm like the worst at all right so these guys yeah oh they're taking some damage that's good I need to remember to press Q if any bullets get too close all right this guy needs to get... Oh. Alright. Whoa. And fun fact with the Trigger Twins, once you beat one, the other one goes insane. Okay, yep. Eat hammer. Alright. That was good. I'm gonna pick this up. Reload. Pick up the keys. 
good old heart of HP. And what is this? The Oni Gunny. Hmm. Or the Ori Gunny. Nice. And I think I can go to that chest now and pick it up. So. What is it? Jar of Bees. I feel like that's not too good, but I can check. Okay, here it is. Carefully trained to hunt down enemy munitions and destroy them. I feel like I should have checked the... No, whatchamacallit. The melted rock. Resonates with the gun-dead corpses, causing them to explode. I mean... Bees to hunt down your enemies sounds a little bit better than just enemy corpses explode, because then I'd have to at least kill a few enemies. Alright. So with these two down, I guess it's on to the next floor. I didn't expect this run to be going so well, so let's head on down. So as long as the flight keeps me good... I'm actually just realizing there's a lot of fire enemies a little bit later on. I hope it doesn't make my uh, wings stop. Alright, so what is it? Ooh. That's a cool weapon. It's like a paper airplane. Oh, wait. Is it homing? Alright, I'm going to save that for a little bit. Actually, I'm just realizing it probably has the most durability out of all my guns. Alright. Then take that down. Refold the gun. <laughs> Alright. Got some... Oh! They don't home in. They just... Take weird curves. Alright. Bees. Eat bees. That didn't do a whole lot. But hey. It was cool. I thought that they were hitting enemies and, like, homing in. Oh, the lead maidens are not nice. I dislike them intensely. Alright. Come on. Hit it. Nope. Alright, I need to blank there. I've never been good with dodging these ones. Come on. Yeah, I always end up running into them like that. Whoa. Alright. You. You need to get out of here. Okay. So, first room on the second floor and already... Actually, this is third room on the second floor. Hammer may just be my savior here. The Huntsman. What is this? A bottle. I can get some armor if I had a little bit more money. I should come back when I'm a little bit mm, richer. <laughs> oh, dynamite. You can use the dynamite to your advantage, which is nice. Alright. Ammo reload on that. And let's see what we got in here. Whoa, another lead maiden. That is a no good. Alright. Need to refold. Need to remember to reload everything. Alright, so... This is a really cool gun. I like it. Whoa. Oh, it's the uh, flare thing in the middle that's causing all these little fiery bullets to appear. Alright. Eat the power of paper. Ooh, getting some HP. Nice. And just for everyone to know... The reason you're not hearing the Enter the Gungeon music is because, well, I can never be too careful with the music. E even if it is, like, not copyrighted and all that, I couldn't find a place that said that it was expressly, like, not copyrighted. So I was like, eh, better safe than sorry. Alright, so let's get through here. That is just a mean room. Oh, and it's just boss fight. Alright. Let's refold the gun. And head back to this room. <laughs> I mean, at least they gave us a teleport there at the end. 
Alright. Whoa. I thought that one of those was walls, so I could actually hide behind them. This gun looks so beautiful when you're using it. Nice patterns. Alright. Let's come down here. What's in here? Nothing. Alright. So let's get over here. Right, take that guy down. Whoa. Okay. So we can use our key here and get... What is this? Infuriating note. You've been had. What does this do? <laughs> Alrighty, so. It's a... Item that's not an item kind of thing. So basically I wasted my key. Fun. Oh. What's this? Oh, it's her again. The pitchfork... The Elder Blank, or the Heart Locket. I'm gonna go for the Pitchfork. Thanks, lady. Yeah, I get it. I'm getting more and more cursed. The cursed actually makes the game harder, which I'm not sure how I feel about that. I mean, yes, I know I'm getting an actually somewhat good run here, but uh, there's the very good chance that it just ends very soon. I think that's one of the jammed enemies there. Hit it. Damn, this guy's some HP. Whoa. Alright. Let's get through here. Figure out what this room is. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's really not good. Alright, I can still dash through them, which is good. Alright. Oh, that's a lot of jammed enemies now. I don't know what the actual odds of them being jammed are, but clearly it's getting pretty high up there. So let's dip in here. Got another key that we need. Let's head over to the shop and... Did he sell a key? Yeah, it was for 25, wasn't it? The 30. I'll buy it. Why not? I want to see what's in the chest. Ooh. What is this? Shotgun coffee. Speed up. Oh, cool. How did this thing fire? It was... Oh, it was just a fireball. Okay. Oh, that was the wrong button. <laughs> I was trying to open up my, uh... My map there. I don't think we'll get to use the bees before the boss fight. Yeah. Alright, so... Into the boss fight. Wonder what we got. I'm gonna use hammer. Oh, it's armor conda. The ammo conda, sorry, not armor conda. Alright. Let's uh do our best. Alrighty. So things are already getting a little bit hairy over here, so I'm gonna try to use the the origami gun here. Alright. I think this boss gets longer as the fight progresses. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, and it also gets a buff, I think. Whoa, okay. Getting too close for comfort, buddy. Eat bees. Alright, yep. I think this is the end of the run here. Where's the boss? Oh, it's down. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna blank. I need to go in and get this guy. Aw. Okay. Well, as for a first game, I think we did pretty well. So, this is where I'm gonna go in and end it. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all enjoyed. And I'll be seeing you all in the next one. Bye, everybody.